Hey, it's a 28 millimeter here. And, uh, I always enjoy listening to the Evil DM with his hey, short. Folks, it is Vince the Evil DM. It's a new week, so it's time for a question for you of the week. DMs out there, DMs out there, how do you handle hydration or water in your campaigns? Usually in fantasy campaigns or post apocalyptic games, water is usually a rarity or not everywhere. Uh, all right, so I'm currently encountering this in, uh, our online game here if you if you watch the uh traveler um uh, live game that i have on thursdays well usually thursdays we've had to uh uh kind of postpone things for just a couple of couple of weeks now we're well, we should be back on this thursday if everything works out okay um but you know real life things you know come up with the players and that's just the way it goes um, but yeah, encountering this in our current game, uh, the players, if you haven't watched, well, the, the players themselves have been, um, are on an abandoned space station right now, and they are trying to seek a way to uh, figure out a way to get off the abandoned space station. Like this space station is way, way out far in the outer reaches of a star system and uh it's it's been mostly stripped and uh you know and uh a lot of materials have been taken away it's still functioning barely there is uh they found out that there's some security robots uh in the vicinity that they've encountered and had uh, a little bit of a firefight with and um they are realizing that uh, every every thing that they do on the space station is can jeopardize their ability to get food or water. And the entire group here, and there is a, quite a number of, of uh, NPCs here with the players because they uh, ended up, um, well, kind of a little bit of the background. You know, they, they ended up being dropped off after they... Uh, after they um, t took over the bounty hunter ship, the lower decks of it, and the bounty hunter ended up, you know, letting them off, so to speak, but dropped them off onto an abandoned space station in order to uh, come back later with uh, reinforcements. So they're fighting a little bit of a time, you know, dilemma here. You know, get off the space station before... The bounty hunter returns with more friends, um, and they had released the the players had released uh, a few bounties that were in a uh, stasis chambers, and uh, so there's a there's quite a few people um, if I recall correctly. There's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, probably ten NPCs and uh, the three players themselves. So. 13 mouths to feed at least there and uh you know and to uh hydrate and the uh space station well there are certain areas that yeah there's going to be possibly water um but a lot of it has been uh you know lost by mishap or depressurization and uh you know vacuum situations where the water goes out of the uh, containers if they're not a, a fully vacuum sealed unit and they've seen this and I've uh, demonstrated uh, you know firsthand for them you know as soon as they end up in a situation where they're opening doors into a vacuum yeah you're gonna see that precious liquid turn solid and shatter away into a million glinting little pieces of crystallized water and yeah it's uh and there are rules in traveler for this kind of situation so i'm using them they are in the uh traveler companion book which i had got like maybe about two weeks ago, three weeks ago, oh no, probably three, well, actually three, three weeks ago when it came in. So when I first started the uh, the game, I didn't have the rules, but I did have the companion rules within uh, Fantasy Grounds. So now I have them in book form, so I can actually read them. So which is nice. 
Um, yeah, so that's, uh, that's what I'm utilizing now. And every, you know, moment that, uh, the NPCs are not being fed or not being, uh, hydrated. And mind you, a few of them here have been, like I say, just, they've been, uh, just taken out of stasis. So, um, within about a day and they have not eaten or, uh, had any water and they're starting to get a little desperate here so it'll be an interesting situation because uh, once desperation kicks in uh, and instinct well you know there people are gonna die for for every last drop here so <laughs> it will be an interesting situation so if you're uh, if you're watching the the uh, video videos on the uh, on the live, uh gameplay well uh hopefully this week everything goes smoothly everybody can make it and uh yeah you're gonna you're gonna start seeing some interesting stuff happening here um alrighty so uh yeah i'm i'm taking care of my my situation with hydration and that sort of thing with the rules in travelers so and uh thank goodness that uh, some uh rule sets do have these uh rules in in place just in case so anyways you guys all take care uh hope to talk to you soon i'm at home waiting for my uh Sa elugu saturn to uh arrive my resin printer is on its way it's saying it's in delivery mode and uh yeah i'm just waiting so i can't wait to get that uh 4k printing and uh yeah it's been a while for uh, Saturns have been around for uh, just a bit over maybe a year or something around there, and uh, yeah, it's it's time to buy before the price of everything goes too freaking nuts because you know inflation. All right, take take care, guys.